We're just nine days away, by the way, from the official start of the hurricane season and AccuWeather is anticipating this to be an extremely busy hurricane season. Just take a look at the forecasts here. We're predicting big number here of named storms. That means tropical storms or hurricanes 20 to 25 well above the historical average. Now within that 20 to 25 we're looking at 8 to 12 hurricanes and four to six direct impacts from these named storms. Also, look at the major hurricanes, four to seven. And what's a major hurricane? That's category three, maximum staying winds of at least 111 miles per hour. And we're looking at four to seven of those major hurricanes above the historical average. The other concern we have is that we are seeing conditions right now that are telling us that we could be looking at these storms rapidly intensifying. What does that mean? That means the strengthening of a 35 mile per hour in winds or more in less than 24 hours. Here's why. Low wind shears, light winds in the upper part of the atmosphere, conducive to development and also abundant moisture. And here's the other thing we're worried about. Very warm water in the Atlantic Basin. In fact, right now we're looking at this ribbon of uh, warm water from the uh, tropical uh, Atlantic all the way into the Gulf of Mexico. This is what we call the MDR. This is uh, the, uh, uh, the location where we see most of the development in the Atlantic Basin. And not only is the water, wa water warm, but this graph showing you that the depth of the warm water is very, very high. That's going to allow these storms to rapidly intensify. And of course, we also have the La Nina, which means less wind shear in the Atlantic Basin, more activity, and the possibility of rapid intensification.